Well, hello everybody and welcome back to the Inner Realms. We're starting off this episode from a brand new chair. That's right, we are up here on our viewing platform, here in our space station, and I've just begun to lay out a rough outline of where I think some of the, you know, the equipment needs to be. It, it's a space station after all, it, it needs equipment, so we've got... Uh, we've got some desks here, and and we've got some little little machines over here. I don't I don't, I don't know what they do, but they're they they got clicky things, and they've got copper shocky shocky things, and they've got a nice seating area where you can overlook the entire station, and they definitely have great views. I mean, look at that base down there. Well, look at this base. You can even see Troja's Western Town from here. Ooh. What's that? Pretty sure that's Dean's new base. Pretty cool, huh? So we've got a ton to get done today. But first off, I want to head over here to the shopping district. Ooh, ooh, there might be some spoilers down there. You didn't see that. But these are definitely not spoilers. Look at this. Look at this the little, the little restaurant. I can't, I can't see it. See, that's poor building, blocking your own building with a, with a lamppost. Look at that. Vegway. Let's check it out. What's this? What? What? Best. Best food options. Other stuff? What's that supposed to mean? Well, let's head in here and see what, uh, what's cooking. Hmm. Another narrow store here. Uh, we got golden carrots. Okay. And see, see, they're only selling by the half stack. We sell by the, by the full stack. I, actually, it's by the double stack over at the pork shop. And uh, glistering melons. Okay, okay. Those are good for potions. And they've got glow berries. Great. Can't, they're, they're not really a good food source. Uh, potatoes. They're okay if you bake them. Carrots are fine. And beets, I don't, to be honest, I've never eaten a beetroot. I'll tell you what. Let's give them a little something else to eat, and, uh, let's see how good of a food source this is. Oh, I, apparently I'm all full up, hunger-wise. But we'll go ahead and eat these today, just to see how good of a food source that they are. Because let me tell you, I, I have no problem eating my veggies. If folks want to eat veggies, that's perfectly fine. But one thing I, oh, there's a sign back there. Future side of Death Wish Coffee and Donuts. Oh, this is awesome. I love how this is becoming like a little restaurant row. It's so cool. But what was I saying? Oh, yeah. I don't mind if people want to eat their veggies. I just don't like picking flakes of gold out of my teeth. I'd rather be eating a protein-rich pork chop snack. Speaking of pork chop snacks, let's, uh, let's see how the store's doing. Oh, uh, looks like we might have sold a few more pork chops. Uh, not, not too many people are taking us up on our wraps. Uh, oh, well, apparently peas are the most successful item in the store. How about over here? Okay. Ooh, somebody's buying the... Oh, I know who this is. This is Miner, because he's got his, he's got his totem set to look like a coffee mug. So we got a totem on dying miner. Looks like miner bought a stack of the old pork chops. I have no, it doesn't look like we sold any cakes and no takeout boxes. Anything in the donations? Nothing in the donations, but I just realized we've got two donation boxes in here and there's something missing from this shop. We don't have any ender chests. Let's fix that. we go one ender chest ready for customers to use and we've restocked the pork chops for all of you lovely pork eaters talking to all my german friends out there we know you love your pork we've restocked the peas and we've added a brand new item souvenir glasses that's right we're offering regular glasses and the new fancy dark glasses. So come on in today to the pork shop. Well, now that the shop is all stocked up, 
Next thing we need to do is head down here to our base. Let's circle around and make our way right in. Oh! There's something here. Thank you for the string. I love it. Blind Cubsy. <gasps> Blind Cubsy, thank you so much for helping us out in the diamond department. Let's toss these in here and make our way into the nether. Um. Um. Guys, I... There's a sign on my nether portal. The queen is coming? What could that mean? You know, I just remembered... We have a book down here that I've done nothing with. Ah, this is that high queen who put up those walls over around Jurassic's base. Yeah, I, I'm not sure I want to get involved with something corrupted. So we're just gonna... Head into the nether and pretend that uh, we didn't see any of that. So we are heading over in this direction. Hmm. Miner told me there's a nether fortress over this way. Let's see if we can find it. There's some signs. Second nether fortress. Hmm. Yep. It's this way. Uh, guys, it's getting dark. This is really far away. Oh no, there's a wall. Oh, okay. I don't know where this goes, but I'm assuming the nether fortress is here in the nether. So let's head down these steps. Oh, oh look. Look, before I head into the nether, I should probably eat something, don't you think? And I've I've got these lovely beet roots here. Let's see uh let's see how they do. I got four haunches down. <laughs> That didn't even fill part of a haunch. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, we're getting... We're... Oh, yeah, we're... Here. Yeah, we're getting like... We're getting like half a haunch. Okay, this is not... This is not one of the best foods in the game. Again, though, I don't mind veggies. If you want to eat your veggies, that's all good by me. I, I'm fine with that. Ah, looks like another fortress. Well, I'm thinking a beacon would be a good thing to have. You know, I mean, if we're going to expand our base, we're going to need to dig through that mountain and... Oh, there's an inner chest right there. Uh, we're going to need to dig through that mountain and I don't want to be mining out slowly. So, let's go get ourselves a beacon. Okay, he's got a little setup room in here. Cleared it all out. Oh. Oh, you know what I didn't get? I didn't get any fire potions. Uh, well, let's see how that works for us. I'm going to stand here for a while and see if I can get some uh, nether skulls. Thanks for clearing this place out, miner. Take care of this guy who is setting fire to us. And that, right there, is what we came to find. Beautiful, beautiful wither skulls. So let's pick that up and keep running around. Ah, he didn't even drop us up. Yeah! 
Did not expect him to be coming from up there. Fortunately, I've got some quality food here. So I'm getting swords like nobody's business. But I am not... Oh, there's somebody shooting at me. <laughs> uh, but I'm not getting... They're not handing out the Wither Skeleton candy. Like we're... Like we want. There, oh, stop shooting me. There we go. Check this out. I mean, I'm getting... I'm getting magma cream. I'm getting blaze rods. Tons of bones and coal. Uh, I'm even getting pork chops from... Those big ol' big ol' hulkers living in the Crimson Forest over there, but they are just not would you stop shooting at me? They are just not handing out the wither skeleton candy. So uh I moved over here to the old nether fortress. I, I haven't been to this one either, and it seems to be just a series of hallways, but I saw these guys, thought I'd give them a shot. And a one, and a two, and a three, and a four, and a five. Yeah, pretty much the same stuff. It's been several hours. Server's not being nice to me. Okay, uh, so what we gotta do is we gotta get this guy, but if I accidentally hit the... I can't accidentally hit the guy. Yeah, go away, go away, go away. You guys stay there. Um, you go away. Uh, can we do this? Yep, that's him. Okay. Okay, we're safe. We're on fire, but we're safe. And we got a couple of these guys, and I know there's a couple more around the corner. Okay, hey, uh, thanks a- thanks a lot, buddy. Okay. Uh, you guys, you guys, come here. Come here. Okay. No heads. Oh, hey. Hey, you. You, you, you. Come here. Give me your head. No head. Come on. And the one. And the two. And no heads. Oh, at last! A second head! Seriously, server isn't liking me today. And I'm the only guy on. And a one. And a two. Nothing. The three. Nothing. And a one. The two. Nothing. I almost, I almost hit him. Oh, that would have been bad. That would have been very bad. You're, you're a good guy. Thank you. Thank you. Oh! Oh! Need a way out. There we go. go and a one. Nothing. And a two. Nothing. Can we just check this? Can we just, can we just check this? 143. That's... That's like 70... 71... Wither skulls. Wither skeletons for... For a head. These are not good numbers. Be my friend, we'll play a little game. It's called I Hit You With The Sword and You Give Me Nothing. Okay, we got you there, but we gotta take out these guys. Actually, you come over here. Can you, can you, you see me? You see me without them seeing me. Yeah, that's a good boy. That's a good boy. You got better eyesight. You're taller, you got better eyesight. You're just all around a more handsomer guy. But you didn't give me a head. I say, there doesn't appear to be that many heads. Where could they have gone? And a one. Ooh, got you in a one, but you gave me not one. Come on, little game. Little game called I Whack You With The Stick. You give me your head. Nothing. You give me so much stuff. But the heads are not among it. I hit you with the stick. You don't drop a head. I don't appear to be very successful at this game. Here's a little game I made up. It makes you dead, but it gives me a head, so don't worry. Be happy. Make me happy, please. Oh, oh you hit me, I hit you back. You hit me, I hit you back. And, oh, oh, isn't it beautiful? Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> it 
It's been so long. Ladies and gentlemen, take a look at what we got. We got more coal than we'll need for a while, especially since we have that lava smelter. Uh, we've got a whole bunch of bones. We just picked up some blaze rods and some magma cream along the way. But this, this right here, that's, that's the thing we need to make a beacon. Now we just have to figure out how to get out of here. Seriously, this place is a maze. Well, we managed to make it out, but not before we got stuck in between a wither skeleton and a magma cube. So, uh, yeah, we lost some stuff. We managed to get our armor back, thanks to Jurassic's, but we lost all of our tools. These are, these are temporary guys. Lost our bow. We managed to get our sword and our elytra back, but... Uh, in between episodes, I'm going to be enchanting some stuff up. I might even have to go get some more netherite. Oh, and uh, I put the wither skulls in the ender chest before we started heading home. <laughs> so, we can make a beacon, but what you're probably wondering is how we're going to make the beacon. Well, you're going to have to wait till the next episode, but let me give you a little hint how we're going to kill the wither. This, my friends, is a woodland explorer map. And I believe no one else has found a woodland mansion yet. So in the next episode, we're going to find it. And we're going to use the wither to help us clear it out. Which means we have just one more thing to do for this episode. Well, actually two things. You need to like and subscribe if you want to see the wither fight in the next episode. And I need to do something about these signs. I'll see you next time on the Inner Realms. <laughs>